Hey guys, welcome back to another More With Mars video. Today's video is going to be a closet makeover. We decided that we were going to work with a company called Modular Closets with this whole closet renovation idea or closet like makeover idea. And I will talk a little bit more about that company in just a little bit, but what I want to do is go ahead and get everything set out in the garage. And I think when it comes with the papers, um, it gives you all of the instructions for the entire closet system, but Brittany also printed out the exact, I guess, layout of where each individual, I guess, closet tower is supposed to go, or like the system is supposed to go. So I'm going to have to match numbers with boxes so that should take just a few minutes but what i actually am going to do after that is i'm going to bring everything up into this uh spare room or this open loft area and, and bring the system in one by one that way i'm not working on it in this small little room so brindy's closet still has a ton of things in it so instead of taking all of this out at one time i was thinking about working on like the walls first like Yeah, so there's a lot of stuff in Brittany's closet, so I'm gonna go ahead and go get everything that I will need for this video, and it's pretty simple. Uh, screw, screwdriver, level, drill, drill bits, that's pretty much it for this entire assembly. Now, there might be a few other things along the way, but we'll get there. You guys, here's all of the boxes for this entire build. I think it come in to be like almost 700 pounds worth of, <laughs> worth of closet material. <sighs> And also here guys, what I what I laid down and what I was talking about earlier is this has each individual number. Part of the closet system goes where, so I'm just going to have to match up these numbers with what is on the boxes here. So it should be fairly simple to find all the right boxes. But yeah, you guys, here is all of the boxes and I'm going to start taking them upstairs. All right guys, so I wanted just to quickly interject on this video and talk about the whole ordering process and how I designed the closet system. So the amazing thing about Modular Closet is they have a modular design tool where you can put in the dimensions of your closet, which is what we did. If you guys can see on the left, we kind of like drew out a little sketch of the size of the, my closet. And then we were able to design everything through their website, which was pretty amazing because not only did we put in the dimensions of the closet, but we were able to completely customize it the way that we wanted to. So they make it really easy with customizing the closet that you are basically going to utilize the most so you can also customize if how many drawers you want what kind of different systems you want if you want more shelves or more racks basically whatever you are going to need the most for your closet so you guys will see here a second more so like the individual systems that we put in there and also on top of that which is pretty amazing you can customize things down to like the drawer pools and the different style drawers as well so i love that they have this whole process where you can basically be your own designer for your closet and if you do need any help they do have a number you guys can call or an email and um you guys can contact them that way if you're needing a little extra help so they definitely have a lot of options to choose from you can see like an overhead view of your closet a wall view a 3d view they have everything set up for you in their design tools so i just wanted to mention that because that helped us a ton with designing my closet So we have the first one finished. Now it took me a long time to figure out what went with what, but 
once I found like the exact model number, um, I was able to go back through the boxes to find the exact pieces that go with this. And I know you guys saw me try to like flip some pieces around because I'm, while I'm trying to put this together, it's very simple and easy to put together. This whole piece was facing the inside. It was supposed to be facing the outside. So it's really easy just to pop it right back off and twist everything around to make it to where you need it to be. But here is the anchor screws that go into the wall itself, into the studs. But I think this piece, because I don't think we got the extenders at the bottom, I think this piece is finished. So I'm gonna set this piece up and put it off to the side and I'm gonna start working on the other pieces. Because like I said, I want to get first three pieces done. That way I can set the farthest one to the wall first and then work my way back because um, they have to be spaced out enough on that back wall so the other uh, pieces of the closet will fit as well. So I'm gonna get back to getting another one of these put together. Like I said, it was like, it was really easy, but it's really time consuming if you can't figure out the right pieces. You guys saw there is a ton of boxes down there and if you, if, it was really hard to sort through what was what, but once I figured out what went where, it was easy. It's really easy. So I'm gonna stop talking now and I'm gonna get back to work. guys so we have two of the three that we needed for the side and Brittany's filming while I'm filming hey I was gonna say that I at least printed out everything for you so I printed out each thing or each yeah because it's making it ten times easier I see which piece goes exactly where yeah, so I did print everything out because we were able to go through the whole design process and it shows like each wall and what piece goes on each wall so you help me out there.
So you guys, I'm not 100% sure if I told you this or not, but these closet systems are a little heavy, so you might need a little extra hand when you're trying to hang these up, especially as as high as we were having them. So what I ended up doing was hanging these shelves. Um, I ended up picking these shelves up so my friend Marco could just use the drill and the stud finder and put these into the studs. That way we really didn't have nothing to worry about. Also, you guys, this is where the modular design tool really come in handy because we got to enter the exact dimensions for our closet and everything that we got from modular closets it fit like a glove and everything did not have to be moved around that much at all just a little bit of spacing between the walls and that was pretty much it everything went in super easy and it was very simple to put together Alright guys, so we have made it to the point where we can start putting in all the shelves and I kind of already started putting in some of the drawers here um, just because I wanted to see how everything was going to look um, but I will show you guys, I will let you guys see me putting in the other four shelves. I think there's four shelves left or four drawers left and then I also have to fill in all of these holes and then we're going to uh, repaint after that. But here's kind of what it's going to look like. I mean, Brittany's got a ton more closet space. And this closet was so big that it was able to fit everything and it still feels like the closet's still big. She's gonna have, have a lot more storage space. So she's got two racks over here and I think this is where we're gonna put baby stuff. And then she's got two racks here, two racks here, and then two racks on this wall as well. All right guys, so here is the after of the installation process. We are extremely pleased with how everything turned out. By adding this new closet system, Brittany will definitely be able to utilize more space in her closet. So you guys need to stay tuned for part two of this video where Brittany will be able to come in and organize her new closet system. And also you guys, we have to give a huge shout out to Modular Closets for collaborating with us in this video. You guys, if y'all are interested in checking out Modular Closets, we will be leaving a link in the description below for you. That way you can just click on it and it will take you right to their website. But that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. We really hope you enjoy this video. And don't forget to like and comment down below, you guys. And we will see you on our next one. Bye, guys.